I'm Erin Reed from Erin Reed Makes, and today with Super Tight, we're going to learn how to fix this broken frame and turn it into a beautiful decor piece with the help with the Super Tight Brush Tip Super Glue and the Thick Instant Super Glue. All right, let's get started. So this frame dropped and it has, it got cracked. I'm going to use a Super Tight Super Glue with a brush tip application, which is great because I need to get into these very small tight spaces to try and apply a thin layer of glue to fix this frame. So here you can see the glue, it opens up and it has a nice light applicator, a brush applicator. So all I'm gonna do is come in and add a nice light brush of glue on all the surrounding areas to give it a nice clean coat everywhere I need the glue applied. And I can slide this back in place. So I'm just gonna give us a few minutes to set before we paint it for the next part of the project. So now my frame is fully sealed. Look, it doesn't even want to budge. It is fantastic. The glue held perfectly. We're going to paint not only the frame, we're going to do this in a really pretty pink, and we're also going to paint a section of chipboard, heavy duty chipboard, to place inside of the frame itself. So I'm going to add a little bit of pink. I might have to do a couple of coats, and the frame is going to be done in this antique white. All right, so it's painting time. Before we glue this in place, now that everything is dry, we're gonna go ahead and quickly place this in here to decide exactly how this is going to fit. We need to mark two holes up at the top, just two very slight little holes, right about here. There we go, so just two easy little holes. Pop this out, and we're gonna go ahead and hole punch those two holes. Now we're gonna use the Thick Instant Super Glue. This is a really nice thick glue, and it'll have an awesome bond. You need to be a little bit quick because this is a super glue, so just make sure you apply your glue evenly going all the way around. And then we're gonna place this in here and give it a couple seconds to dry. So while the frame is drying, we're gonna go back to our brush tip applicator because this guy is gonna have a nice thin coat, really simple for applying a little bit of just a nice little layer right here. It's gonna go all the way around. This is gonna be perfect for applying our rope at the bottom. So I have a nice thin coat I can use place my brush right back inside there. And then I'm gonna come in very quickly and place my rope on here and just wind it around. Once you've wrapped around a couple of times, snip off the end and you're set to go. Now my finger touched a little bit of that super glue and I got a little spot on my glass. So I'm gonna use the Instant Adhesive Cleaner. It's acetone free and odor free, just a little drop. It's a little drop on there and you can use your finger. All of these products are super safe to use that using your hands is no big deal. So just a little wipe there and it is all gone. Super easy. So now we're gonna apply the top portion of the glue. Again, we're gonna use our little brush tip and I'm just gonna brush along the tops right here in this section to get rid of the screw tip. So just coat that top very liberally. Just make sure you get all the little nooks and crannies. We're gonna find the center to our twine here. So we have our center and we're gonna start off by going through the middle and then wrapping this around. And you can kind of wrap it around a little figure eight pattern. Just get this whole, whole part completely wrapped. If you feel need to add a little bit more glue because you missed a section, just go ahead and apply a little bit more and you are good to go. So just wrap up the top. So just tie a single overhand knot, and now we're gonna bring back our frame, and we're just going to gently place this, because this is gonna fit right here. We're gonna end up gluing these two pieces in a minute. We're gonna take each one of our pieces of twine, and we are going to wrap them through here. So pull them through. We're gonna wrap through and go through our hole a couple of more times. Now we have the bottom place. We're gonna go back in with our thick instant super glue. We're just gonna place a little dab of glue on the back side of each of the pieces of rope. Place this down, rest it. Make sure you get the bottle exactly in the right, because it's gonna dry really fast, so make sure you place it exactly where you want to, and then give a few seconds to dry. Thank you so much for joining me and learning how to make this upcycled mini framed vase perfect to show off those fresh picked flowers or also the beautiful fake flowers that you might have, all using super tight glue. Thank you so much for watching, bye-bye.